Yo guys, it's Tony the Hotman. Today's video, I just got Henry Hustle from my local Spirit Halloween. They got a giant shipment. And if you did see my Instagram story, they had four shorties, um, two Henry Hustles, a Pennywise Sewer Grate, three Experiment Fours, and a Ghost Face. And so I ended up getting Henry Hustle today and bring it in box it and do set it up and do a demo. Here we go. Alright, here is Henry Hustle. Got the, the side image there, and this one does have handles. And this, I know this is the same thing as Harriet Hustle, where you open it up and you slide it out. There we go. Alright. I already see, oh god, I haven't seen Henry Hustle in real life. Super clean box. Pretty decent sized box, but not, nothing, nothing big, big. All right, now everything comes nice and tidy in here. And already right off the bat, see his head. But right here, we got his adapter. We got an adapter right there. Got one of his arms. This, looks, this is the left arm. We got his upper clothing piece, like his shirt. Oh gosh. I'm, seeing everything real in person right now. Got his two black and red shoes. Really cool, different color shoes. We, I don't think we've seen that before. His two shoulder um, uh, pieces. Wow. His demon head, which is uh, all plastic and very light. That's good to know. But this is the first time I'm seeing everything in person, so it's kind of crazy for me. Wow. All right, look at that. That's detailed. I love that. And we've got his another thing like Harry Hustles, and this one says Henry Hustles. That has all his screws and stuff. And here is his other arm. With I'm not really sure if that's a mech or not, but this is more where his arm bends like that. Then we got his pants right here, like so. Pretty cool. Looks like we need some scissors. He got one of his neck collars and two of his neck collars. And another one of these uh, knee things with hair, with Harriet Hustle. These were a pain. Got one of those. Got the, the hat. And here is his, the original. Oh, wow. That's cool. I like that. <laughs> Kind of squishy, funny, fuzzy, um, like funny nose. All right, here is the mech that makes his arm move, and it has a big old wire coming out of it. Extra cardboard, instructions. This guy has a lot of parts. Got a hip loop here. Then here are his Joker cards. Wow, these are big. Cool. And then we do. Got some zip ties, which I can just break off with my hand. Alrighty. This is the center center control piece. And with some pull zip tie to that. And here is this wooden base. Not that big, but it's very heavy. And then we got this little box here with his mech in it. All right, let's lay everything out nicely and let's see what he comes with. All right, guys, got all this stuff laid out. Comes with a lot of parts, got his instructions, got his mechanism here, really com complicated. Two poles, we're, we're in that long box, control box, within a little container that's a Henry Hustle in it, same with the screws. Got his two playing cards there, three, well, actually, two sets, basically. Bottom clothes, his, neck ruffle and his top ruffle two shoulder pieces um, um that go on top of this got his main center module his hat his top head a hip loop a arm mechanism three 
shoulder and knee forms, two shoes, two arms, the demon head, the clothing, and the adapter. All right, guys, let's set them up. I have the base, and it has two front things. Do you want to put that in the front? Do you want to grab these two little poles, not labeled, they're basically the same. And with the snap pins, you put them in, like that. And the other one, like that. So those are both in. Now you want to grab the shoes. Yep, and the black one goes on the right. Like that. So that's where we're at right now. Has a little hip loop on it. Then slide it over. One on. One. Super easy. Next step, want to grab his module thing like this and then snap pin it on. That's on. Now, we wanna grab, oh, this is, the, this is the part I'm dread, dreading. Smack. All right, looks like we have to get some scissors. And I've heard this is one of the worst parts where you put the spring in and sometimes it launches back at you. I'm gonna cut that. And I'm gonna cut the one down here. It's all plastic, which kind of worrisome. Right, I'm not sure if there's a top or a bottom. I'm gonna uh, cut back when I put the spring in because it's gonna take me a long time. Here you go. All right, got the spring in. Wasn't that bad, but I would suggest sitting down on tables then putting it in like that. That was very simple. All right, now we want to attach this to here. Center of his controls. With these screws, these little black screws, so I would, will do that off camera. All right, got that screwed in. Very easy, just put a mechanism on the back side and screw it in with two black screws right here and here. And now we wanna grab the big old control box and I'm gonna crank it. All right, got that on. And now, next step is about that next step is now we got to get the demon head and snap that pin on like that demon head is on now we want to pull up his overalls Not overalls, but clothing piece, if you would say. Right. Thing to hold his pants here. Shoes all properly and nice. All right. Next step, these little poles. Oh, wow. Jesus, mercy. All right. This one goes here. Stepping on everything. This one goes here. And that one goes here. Alrighty. Now, you wanna grab this and put it right in here. These are all snap pins, no screws necessary to put his arms on. All right, that's on. Cool, cool. Now, this die. It's all Velcro at the back. I think the Velcro is all the way down. Nice, it does. You come and put it through the left arm, right arm, sorry. All right. Got that on. Looks like there's some type of snap kind of pin or whatever. I gotta poke it through.
it looks like it's pretty on there solid, so we'll see what happens with that. Oh, it's good from the front. Yeah, it doesn't really seem like I have to screw. It's, it's telling me to screw it, but it doesn't really look like it. This kind of neat. Um, this is the elbow cuff here. And this goes on his elbow band thing. Then like that. That's his elbow it's for his left hand. Alrighty. Big old elastic, big old elastic band around his wrist. All right, guys, I'm having a really hard time and confusing how to put this cards into his hands. But I'm watching other people's videos in a instructional setup of how to put it on. They're saying, keep them. I'm, I'm going to do what they're doing because it looks like they're going really fast. So I'm going to put the head on. And now I'm going to screw both of the both of these um, screw this top head on right now off camera. All right, now I'm grabbing these shoulder form pieces and going one by one on like that like that and then do the same with the other side all right now i want to grab this hip loop and put it around the head and then connect it like that and like that all right i finally got the damn cards and i have to use my own screws i just couldn't find out how to do it and now got this fork connection and I'm going to fork connect it like that. And now this arm is poseable, so I'm going to bend it to normal height. And then I'm going to put his cloven piece around like that. And then how, how about we say we come back when he's all complete and ready to do a demo. So here he is. Here's the setup parchment. And now let's plug him in and do a demo. All right, guys, I just plugged him in. And he did reset. I hope he is set up properly. I'm not 100% about this elbow piece, but we'll have to see here. All right, I had to set the phone down for a little bit. This is the time we've all been waiting for. Really kind of sketched out. I'm ready to unplug it. All right, guys, I just did accidentally did a demo for me. It does work Step perfectly right fine. Up and pick a car. Perfectly fine. Hmm. It seems you've picked the card of death. <laughs> He's super cool and he works great. I'm really happy to see that. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. He's an awesome animatronic. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.